can place type definitions and strict type definitions And let's check. This is a type def, and this ring is strict type def. So we can place uh, type definitions and strict type definitions on the front panel or block diagram. The same way we can place any custom control or indicator on the front panel or on the block diagram. When we right click an instance of a type definition or a strict type definition, the shortcut menu in the includes type definition options. like review and update from type definition if there is problem with the type definition auto update from type def open type def disconnect from type def we can open the type definition or strict type definition from the front panel or from the block diagram by right clicking the instance and selecting open type def from the shortcut menu We can identify the instance of a type definition or strict type definition on the block diagram with a glyph marking the upper left corner of the instance. If we hover the cursor over the glyph A tip strip displays the name of the type definition or strict type definition. Changes we make to type definition affect instances placed on block diagram as constants in the same way the changes affect front panel instances. So if this boolean is changed to let's say numeric then the change is applied on the block diagram as well. If we change a strict type definition instances placed on the block diagram as constants act as if the link is not strict and LabVIEW updates the constants only with data type changes as we saw a moment ago. For example, if we update the string values in a string control 
saved as a strict type definition first let's clear everything And then let's select ring strict type def and place it and let's check it that it is strict type def so if we update the string values in a string control saved as a strict type definition lab view does not update instances of the strict type definition placed on the block diagram because the string values are not part of the data type of the string control. So this one has the values of 1, 2, 3 and if we change it to let's say numeric 1 numeric 2 and numeric 3 then those changes are not reflected.